What is up guys? I hope you are all having a great day. So here's an update. I have been in touch with a company called Evolution. You might have seen them in GNC, uh, bodybuilding.com, just any like sports store, lifting store, um, even on their page, however. Um, but yeah, we've been chatting it up and they sent me some free products to, uh, to test out and I'm gonna show you what they came packaged like. Two shirts. I will pop these open right now. This is a tank top, which you know I like being as naked as possible in the gym. That's what we're looking at right here. And second, they sent me just a regular t-shirt here. It'll look good, especially with the, the hair being, you know, like a contrasting color. And then lastly for clothing, they sent me a snapback, which you don't see me wearing hats very often um, because that's social media. Um, I'm usually making sure that my hair looks good and. I have a clean face and um, all that. So when I'm not on social media, I will be wearing hats and I'll, I'll toss this one on. Um, but yeah, check it out. Now for what I'm really excited about, because I was actually just running, I just ran out of pre-workout, ran out of amino acids. Firstly, I'm gonna start off with these BCA Energy. Um, I got the Pink Star Blast. Well, here's a funny thing. I didn't know, because I, I wasn't paying attention to like brand names, um, I didn't know Evolution this is the amino acids I've always gotten for the past like four or five years. It finally clicked when they like I spoke to them. I was like, wow, I've been buying this this product for forever. So I was I'm definitely on board for them to keep sending me stuff if they do. So one thing that I want to say with with this the BCA Energy is if pre workout because sometimes it is like this for a lot of people it might make you like cracked out of your mind and you might feel itchy. You might even get lightheaded. It might just be too much for you. Um, I mean, you could do like just a, a different form of caffeine if you want like a cup of coffee, but if you're like me, when I drink coffee, it kills my stomach and then I have to use the bathroom. Um, but if you want something lighter, the BCA Energy is definitely the route to take. My puppy's playing with a toy. Um, anyways, stop! Anyways, BCAAs are shown to decrease your muscle soreness this the following day, which will help in not damaging your muscles so much, give you a faster recovery so that you can get out there and give 100% again. The second product that I want to introduce is a pre-workout, which this packaging is sick. Look at it. I don't know how much it's going to show um, on the camera. But when you move it, it just changes how it looks. I already have a lot of energy when going to the gym, but I still like to take pre-workout because I, I feel like I go 100% without it. But with it, I'm going like way beyond that. So I'm really, really, really killing it at the gym. And I'm, I'm all about getting these gains, getting super, like super in shape. My strength is going through the roof. And this one actually has um, like a shredding effect to it. So I'm going to hopefully, see, I don't, I don't want to lose weight but I want to definitely shred my body up so I can be like the most lean, fit athlete that I can be. And um, I feel better now at a lower weight, so I wanna just continue to shred my body fat back, just become as absolutely ripped and sh shredded, shred, um, as much as possible. So this one I am super, super excited about. Pump mode, check it out. Um, so what this does is it's of course gonna help me get a better pump and it's gonna release um, Well, it's gonna enhance more of my nitric oxide in my body, which what nitric oxide is going to do is um, it relaxes like your like um, like inner muscles and It will also relax the best like the blood vessels in your body Which will then help them widen up. So when you're pumping blood through it your arms are gonna start to get wider because all those blood vessels are getting bigger. Lastly, the way that I'm gonna take these is when I go to the gym, I'm going to put some of this in a shaker. I will then put a scoop of this in the same shaker, even though that this is flavored and that's flavored, it doesn't matter because I'm just gonna chug it anyways. But I'm gonna mix the pump and the pre-workout together, shake it up, drink that sh and then go kill my workout. I'm gonna go ahead and work out right now with this pump mode and a pre-workout and I will come back and I will let you know how I feel. By the way, this right here is my cat, Bella. Bella, say what's up to the camera. Um, she's been chilling here the whole entire time. I actually forgot that she was here, but now you know this is my cat, Bella. And if you touch her back, it puts the butt up. Super excited, I'm ready to go get this lift and I'm gonna kill it. So I don't know why I didn't think of this before. Um, another thing, I'm wearing the tank top. I'm going to the gym, but I'm gonna do an individual taste test and I'll let you know 
Um, I might as well do that instead of just mix them both together and then be like, yep, it's okay. We're gonna take the pre-workout first. So this is the first taste of cherry limeade. That's really good. Uh, on a taste scale, I'm gonna, I'll give it a nine out of 10. Cherry's not my favorite, lime's not my favorite, lemonade's not my favorite. Of course, I can't just drop it a 10, like that combination's not gonna be a 10 for me, but I give it a nine because I see the potential that is there. All right, next up, we are gonna be working with the pump mode. Um, this flavor is watermelon. Now, watermelon is actually a flavor I love in any drink. This is definitely like a little different of a powder. It's not as like fine as the pre-workout and like how protein is. It seems a little bit like rocky. So we'll see how this breaks up and see how it tastes. All right, so that's like super packed. Wow, so it's actually pretty good. It's a little bit on the sour side, so I'll give it a nine out of 10. So sometimes I would have a problem with like a sour pre-workout, which would throw my stomach off like a little bit and I wouldn't want to drink it and then like go work out because I feel bad. So what I expect today is I'm gonna be like super cracked out. I'm gonna have a really good pump. I'm gonna get a full long workout in. It's not gonna be like an hour and crash 100% energy by an hour and a half. I will definitely say this product is awesome. So it's been like five minutes since I've taken the pre-workout and I'm already feeling pretty tingly. Um, that's like the effect of the product. Like that's what's gonna happen to most people depending how, how it hits your body. Damn, I gotta go lift. Like I gotta go pump some iron and get swole. <sighs> Am I doing too much? Am I doing too much, buddy? Oops. Oh my God, relax. Sometimes I like to just sit down Come right next to my buddy who I have been best friends with for like seven years, right? We've been killing it together. Can you shake? Right, but before I leave, guys, Hoops, Tonka, Mocha, who's like 127 years old, Bella, I expect you all to behave. I don't want a mess when I come back. Hoops, can you pick up your damn toy? Hoops, get the toy. Get the damn toy. I'm so tired of you leaving a mess everywhere. What do you have to say about yourself? Nope. You're literally so lucky that it is wet out right now because if it wasn't wet out, I would rip you to the ground and you would just be dead. I swear. Talk to me one more time, I swear you to God. Suck. You know you... That's what I thought. There's a, there's a quote and it goes, motivation is what gets you started and habit is what keeps you going. Sometimes happiness and like feeling good about yourself, you have to work for that. Being fit is not for everybody and that is okay. But like there is so many positive effects about being in shape and working out and just feeling good about yourself. So here are some of Scotty's tips that will help you start going to the gym. Tip number one is get a haircut. Go to a barber shop where they actually know what they're doing, line you up, shape you up, however you want, just so that you look good because you'll feel better about yourself. Step two, buy some new clothes. Upgrade your wardrobe, look dope as hell, and then you're gonna feel even better about yourself. Three, buy supplements. Even if you don't want to take supplements that bad, for example, pre-workout, if I take pre-workout, there is no way in hell that I'm gonna miss the gym. I will literally tingle so much and shake and I'll get so hyped up, I can't just sit around and do nothing. So pre-workout kind of just makes it so there's no way, like I said, no way in hell that I'm gonna miss the gym. And then you'll start showing up and then those, like from step three of the getting the supplements, now step two, you're gonna fill out those clothes better. Then step one, your face is gonna look better because you're not gonna work out your face, but your face with your hair and everything, that's why I dye my hair, that's why I pierce my ears, sometimes I wear a fake nose ring. You guys might not think that any of that's cool, but for me personally, I feel really good about myself and I feel like I'm trendy. Now I'm cracked out of my mind on this pre-workout. I'm loving it right now, I'm hoping I don't crash. I might be using uh, like blah, 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 blah. All right, so workout completed. I felt great throughout the whole workout. I lasted about an hour and a half. Um, at one point, I actually had so much energy that I was like, okay, I've hit, I've hit like 12 sets now, and it's been like 15 minutes. Like I was just like out of my mind. So then I slowed down a little bit so that I wouldn't go through my workout in 30 minutes. All in all, I recommend the pre-workout and the pump mode. The pump mode actually, like my biceps became so ridiculously tight that towards the end of my workout, I couldn't even flex like my arm without massively cramping. So like there was a ton of blood flow going in there. In terms of crashing, um, I don't feel 
feel the crash effect where I just like feel like crap right now. Like I would be speaking to you, like I have a lot of energy still, but if I didn't, I would be speaking like very slow. Now we're gonna go home, edit this video. I wanna get the content out to you guys. I honestly have so much energy still left that when I take my protein, I'm not gonna take my aminos right away because I don't want even more energy. So I'm just gonna take my aminos um, after my meal so that I can digest that protein from the meal um, better. That is all I got today. I know that this video was a lot of talking, but I wanted to get a review to you guys about this product. It was super nice of them to send me some stuff and I'm gonna be posting about it on my social media. Uh, and I'm just really happy that, you know, things are turning up in a positive way. Like I said in the last video, my body's feeling great and I'm just excited for what's to come. I have some big news that like, it's an opportunity right now. I don't know if I'm gonna get it, but I'm super excited if I do to like announce it. I'm gonna be so hyped. Uh, but yeah, I will catch you guys in the next video. The next video I promise is gonna be much more exciting, but if you're able to last throughout the whole video here, you are a loyal, loyal subscriber, and I really appreciate you guys. Scotty Dunks out.